hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is shannon if you are new here today we are going to be doing a cleaning video for you guys because we have a our first halloween party on saturday and the house needs some care so i am going to start in the guest room because we're gonna have some people staying with us saturday night so i'm just gonna get that all like reset refreshed and clean for them and i'm also going to be switching out some decor pieces there are some things in here that i just don't like anymore and we're trying to turn our house like modern farmhouse so um, i'm just going to be switching out some decor pieces and cleaning in here and then that should take me to the time where i have to go pick colton up from school so then when i get back i will finish up like the rest of the house so let's get started This room doesn't get used very much, so in here is basically just dusting, sweeping. I had just washed the sheets a couple days prior, and I had also mopped a couple days prior, so those are two things that I'm not going to be doing in here. But I'm just going to dust and rearrange some of the decor and switch some of the pieces out. This room spray is from Kirkland's and it is the pumpkin spice scent and I am obsessed, you guys. Next, we are moving on to Colton's room and you may notice that his room is not as bad as you have seen it in the past. We actually went through together decluttered, organized, and he got a kick out of me labeling things like where his uh, cars go, his monster trucks, and you guys, I think it honestly helped because he actually wants to put things back like where they're supposed to go. So there is a little tip for you guys. Obviously, my five-year-old can't read, but like I told him like you know what it said and where things go and he just kind of remembered it so there's a tip if you guys want to try it out with your guys as kiddos I recommend it you guys may notice that I am not vacuuming the hardwood today Sometimes I do, but sometimes I just feel like you need to get in there with a broom and a dustpan. I don't know exactly how well the hardwood floor setting works on a vacuum, but there's just nothing like a freshly swept floor. Okay, so I'm not going to lie. This was the hardest room to film for you guys because of how small it is, but obviously we had to... Um, take some size away from this one to get like the master bath that we wanted and I knew this was going to be Colton's slash like guest bathroom and Colton's small right now so not a big deal for him but this was such a pain in the butt to film but I wanted to get it done for you guys and also in this frame I realized that I had my camera backwards so I wanted to keep it in so you guys could see what I was doing, but I am very sorry for the stand being in like half the frame. Next, we are moving on to our bedroom. This also was a room that didn't require too much work. Nick had actually made the bed for me um, earlier in the day, which I super appreciated. So shout out to him for being the best. Um, but I just wanted to do a little dusting in here. And right here, I had lost the battery to the remote. It had fallen and then everything, of course, fell out. Um, but this was just mainly sweeping, dusting, stuff like that. 
Now we're in the master bath and I'm just going to clean the mirrors, clean the countertops, sweep the floor, clean the toilet, you know, all the stuff that you would normally do. course Paris is never far from my side does anybody else have a dog that like follows them around the house no matter where they go like Paris loves everybody in the household but he is definitely my baby let me know in the comments below what your dog does obviously this is later at night after we had put Colton to bed I didn't want to clean like the common areas while he was still awake because of course that would be pointless so we waited until he went to bed and then we just wanted to, you know, spruce up the living room a little bit and in the next couple clips you'll see why the kitchen and dining room needed some TLC. It was really bad, you guys. I try really hard for our kitchen table not to become like a catch-all, so it's either the counter right there like the island portion or things get put back but i don't know what happened this day you guys it's like a tornado went through the kitchen One thing that I love about Nick is when I start to do the dishes, he just comes over and dries and puts them away. Like I don't ever have to ask him to and it's just the small things like that that really help and you know just like show like why you're with that person. Like if you ever have doubts or something, I don't know but I just really appreciate that and I need to tell him that more because sometimes it's easy to just think people can read your mind. So that's going to bring us to the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the first clean with me in the new house. There are many more to come, I am sure. I'm just going to finish up by cleaning the rest of the countertops and then sweeping the floor and then we are going to go relax. So thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!